<laughs> Holy mother of hello! <laughs> hello! <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm alright. This is a bit loud, but um, this is something I'm not very used to. No. It's nothing in my world. Welcome to Anna's TV. My name is Pete. My name's Rabir. And this is the uh, show with. Ruby and Pete. We still don't have a name. No, we're still so. looking for the name. There were some good suggestions out there. Uh, the Dane and the Gentleman, I like that one. That was pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, and there was a few others, but uh, keep them coming. We're going to have a little meeting at some point and sit down and actually talk about it. We will, we are, we are. What are we doing today? We're doing Schechter. Schechter. We're doing Schechter because Anderton's has got a mahootive sale on, uh, on Schechter guitars. Uh, we've got some banshees here today. Mm. Uh, but there are, uh, they've got Hellraisers, they've got C1 Custom, they've got Blackjack SLX, they've got Zachary, Saki, Zaki Vengeance, I guess. Something like that, uh, probably a custom model. They've got some Jeff Loomis, they've got some Jerry Horse, they've got some Diamond Series, mm. and they've got loads of left handed as well. So for those of you who are looking for a cool left handed guitar, uh, brilliant. Uh, it's the sale of all sales for all things it, Schecter. It is. It is. There's loads of it. Yeah. And, and uh, they start about three seventy nine. That's just you know, ridiculous. Which is, I think the guitar that you have there, which we can start with, okay. is... Straight up, this is the Banshee A, and this is sort of bottom of the range, but it's not bottom of the range because it's spec'd out to the max. You've got a trans black flame top, hip shot hardtail, you got the 81 and the 85, uh, three-way turn and volume, and then you've got a five-piece neck, mm. and this is maple and walnut, yeah, which is killer. And this is coming on all of these, isn't it, as well? Yes, which is really really nice. Yeah. Um, and then obviously you've got string through sort of uh, setup going on, and then you've got Schecter's own locking tuners. Yeah. So I mean, it's kind of, and it's twenty-four frets. Exactly. It, it feels it. solid. It's an older body. Yeah. As well, it's got a uh, an ebony fretboard. It's lovely. Yeah, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that for for for, for three hundred and seventy nine pounds. No, and I'll, I'll give you a very quick demonstration of yeah. some tones. I got I got the VX Kraken. Hello. Represent, and I've got the uh, <laughs> the T Rex Creamer in a Wazacraft delay going on in loop. So just a couple of quick tones. I mean, even though they're playing, it's first thing in the morning, so you know I'm gonna hold my hands up and say. But what's nice is it does the harmonic overtone feedback. It goes yeah. into that feedback, which is lovely. Yeah. That's easy to do. Uh, it's tight. You know, the EMGs sound really tight, so you can get the chugs. Um, and it's very. It's got a lot of clarity. Yeah, and it's not. It's not something that I play a lot of this music. So uh, I'm a bit. Uh, I'm not new to it, but uh, <laughs> out of his depth. <laughs> I'm out of my depth here. Uh, but what I have here is is also it's the FR, so it's the Floyd Rose mm -hmm. version of what you have. So uh, Floyd Rose is not something I've had since I probably was 14 years old, uh, but it's very fun. It's I almost like it. the same guitar, isn't it? It's almost the same guitar. Yeah. Uh, again, it's an older. It's a 25.5 scale, mm -hmm. uh, really slim mm. neck, which which you know, it's it's like. Not this, nothing of it. Yeah. I feel like I'm kind of, oi, where's the neck gone? Because <laughs> I'm used to just struggling with guitars and this is very, very easy to play. Everything's mm. set up nicely. Uh, and this is 399. So it's the 1000 series Floyd Rose, isn't it? I would assume. I would assume. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Same as that one mm -hmm. with the Floyd Rose. And Floyd Rose goes like this. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let me play some tones. So I'm plugged into a Fender amp. Um, don't try to guys in clean tones. Mm -hmm. uh, I've got an, an Andy Timmons uh, JS, JHS pedal mm -hmm. and a carbon copper <laughs> delay pedals. So uh, clean tones for a pickup. You can play blues on this thing. <laughs> <That's great. laughs> so that, it's not a bad tone, is it actually? No, it's lovely. Mm -hmm. 
See, this is the stuff that I would play. Anyway, so middle position, both pick up, so. Oh. Very spanky and funkies. Uh, back pick up here. Again, it's again, it's kind of a uh, you know. Nice, not, not nothing wrong with that at all. Let's put some uh, Andy Timmons up in in the guitar. I can't help myself great. with that thing. It sounds good, doesn't it? Mm. And it's like, it's, um, see? A Fender Hot Rod can sound. I was gonna say. <laughs> like, it, 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 you wouldn't expect it. No. But actually, the Andy Simmons pedal is really good as well. It makes stuff. Um, but a clean sound of this is, is, I'm really surprised. Lovely. Anyway, so, that, so that's that one. Um, and that's $3.99. Yeah. I mean, all the body. You, you get you get all the stuff that you need, you know. You get a locking system here. You you know. Put it this way: if I was in the market for a guitar that I wanted to sort of level up from, say, my Epiphone or my Squire or something, and I wanted yeah. to then bridge a gap and move to the next level, this yeah. would be a prime candidate for that. Because if you if you're into the Floyd Rose or not, either one of these is going to sort you out because it just they're solid. Yeah, and they're active as well, which means yeah. that there's a, there's a lot. You know, you get you can get a lot of tones out of them for the for the active. And I think as we maybe by accident quite clearly just demonstrated that you can do blues and the spanky funk, <laughs> yeah. and you can do rock and metal. On exactly. Them. So you know what, what's not to like about these? They're yeah. great and and they look good. They built the build quality is amazing. Mm. South Korea, There's, these are made. South in. Korea, yeah. you know, a lot of guitars are made there these mm. days. But if you want, you know, if you want to bang for your buck, I guess that's where you you know you get stuff made and and everything feels nice. Nice yeah. bold on neck here. A little thing here for the battery. Um, nothing good, wrong man. with that for that. Tusk nut. That. Tusk nut. Yeah. Exactly. Flame so. maple top. All the good things that, that... All the bells and whistles. All the bells and whistles. So we, we should probably add that they come in different configurations. Obviously, yeah. we're playing six strings. Yeah. But... Now I'm going to really get out of my, out, <laughs> out of my depth now because this is something that I do not know anything about. But they, um, yeah, but there as well. Go on the website. We're gonna put the links just before we move on to the scariest bit of the day. We're gonna <laughs> I'll put the links in below for for uh, for the for, on the Anderson's website where you can see all of these guitars and on all of the prices. Um, and then you can go in there and have a look and see the guitars. We are only doing the banshees today because there is literally you know, loads. There's loads of them. Anyway, moving on really quickly. <laughs> We got seven, seven strings. Doing. Yeah, we, we got seven something. and eight strings. Here oh. we go. Right, okay, so <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna. I'm feel like I'm gonna make a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, like you're you know, talking. Look at that. <laughs> wow. Play, I can play cricket with this neck. They are, but they look really good. Again, you know, okay. it's as as it's not necessarily a guitar that that I would sort of go for in the shop, but they no. look really nice. And you know, I've, I actually have. I had a couple of sectors, yeah. and they're always. I've had a solo vintage, which they is don't more disappoint, do they? No, this no. always a nice guitar. They yeah. always sounds good, and it's always the, the action is always nice, and it stays that way. You know, I had one with a Bixby on it, which was really cool. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, jump straight in and talk about this one. Yeah, go for it. I have not really played an eight string before any of you guys comment. I'm just saying, I'm not an eight string player. However, this is extremely nice. So again, we got the trans, but it's a purple burst. Uh, flame top going mm. on here. Prince again, would love it. It's the elder body. <laughs> it's a five piece neck again with the walnut and the maple. We got the Schecter locking tuners. We got a hip shot hardtail. I believe it's got a carbon fiber reinforced neck. I see. As well. Oh yeah, because of, probably because of the uh, width that, of it. Exactly, the, and the, this the, this sheer tension that tension, getting, yeah. that would be on the neck. Yeah, um, and we got the EMG eight hundred eight set. Um, so it's different pickups, but. To be honest, they'll be voiced for this guitar because you're going an extra two strings lower. Yeah. So what have you got there? What are the lower strings? Are you got E? Yeah, and then B, B and F sharp. F sharp. Believe, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's ridiculous. So yeah, again, the the hip shot eight string bridge, and hip then shot. we've got the tusk nut. 
and we've got the ebony board 24 frets it's a machine and it sounds <laughs> <laughs> and oh it's it's it is three uh, 569 pounds for the extra two strings <laughs> strings baby right here we go oh my god <laughs> It's so disorientating. I mean, I mean, could you not just do a, a guitar with these three strings if you want to play down there all yeah, the time? Well, I guess. I think most people, and I'm trying not to generalize, but I think if you're <laughs> going to buy one of these, let's face it, right? You're yeah. going to be playing. Yeah, I, I think mean, so. Uh, well, there might be, you know, there might be some that can do some of that stuff. Hello. Yeah. Well, I guess as well, it's worth noting that I'm using the Kraken with the bass focus switch pushed in so that I can get a uh, more clear low end. More tight sort of. So <laughs> you play that classic rock riff, but down in F sharp, it sounds super meaty. Oh my good lord. Okay, well, I guess it's my turn then, is it? It's your turn. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> good, good luck. Seven string guitar, my, my, good, my goodness, goodness. So, th so this is the uh, it's a 7A, mm -hmm. the Banshee 7A, and it's got the same pickup, so the 85 and the 81, but the seven string version, uh, it's got all the same specs as, as your one. Mm -hmm. um, nothing, yeah. you know. Absolutely the same. Uh, it's got strings goes right through there. Mm -hmm. Same yeah. color. They kind of come as a pair, I guess, don't they? Yeah. But oh, I think so. You got an extra string. Yeah. Well, at this price, you could almost afford buying both of them. How much is the seven string? Uh, it's uh, five thirty nine. It's ridiculous. It's really cheap. Anyway, okay, I guess I should play something on this then. Gee, okay, so. Uh, yee, I'll, Better just press the pedal down, don't I? I should really just press the pedal, shouldn't I? Yeah. <laughs> you need to show me. That was actually quite a cool riff. Was it? Yeah. Hang on, hang on, let's try again. So, uh... Oh, I don't really know, but it sounds great. Yeah, you know what I mean? it's I'm, still I'm nice and tight though. <laughs> it's nice and tight, I've got reverb on here as yeah. well, which, which I can try to turn down. But I think what's nice is they've made the EMG pickups they've chosen work really well for that. It does, yeah. it does. Let's try it without some reverb. <laughs> that's my first experience with seven string. That's great. So I had no idea. But that's, that's great guitars, man. Absolutely great guitars. And if you want to check them out, go on the website. Links below. My good lord, yeah. I mean, they feel good. Skinny necks. Yeah, I mean, you can't really go wrong, can you? Not really. I mean, not for price. that kind of price point. No. But yeah, these have been the Schecter Diamond Series Banshee. Banshee. All right, guys. I think we need to play us out with this uh, on these two uh, uh, magnificent instruments. Now, if you are watching in the future, the guitars might be gone, so, mm. you know. Uh, Make sure you get onto Anderton's Quick Time if you're in the market for a new guitar, because exactly. they're on sale. They're on sale and now. they're not going to last long. Right now. Yeah. Uh, went on sale a few days ago, so it, they won't be long. But I think we need to uh, play oh, some God. stuff. <laughs> and uh, I'm Pete. <laughs> and I'm Rabir. And uh, this is Anderton's TV, and thank you for watching.
Oh. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I do enjoy that top, though. That's what happens when you've got kids.